Hi, in this video we are going to uh, discuss how to connect multiple camera modules to drone engage. We start with a port that runs Ardu Pilot. This port can be a STM32 board or a Linux based board such as Opel. Then we will use a Raspberry Pi 4. Uh, Raspberry Pi 4 will run drone engage that means it will run communicator module that is responsible for uh, connecting this port to the internet server or your local server and we run Mavlink module that is responsible for con uh, connecting uh, with uh, Ardupilot port and exchanging Mavlink messages and controlling the board and because we want to connect a camera we will run the camera module. The camera module will read the video stream from the camera and will uh, stream it using WebRTC protocol. The, now we want to add another camera or another device to capture HDMI uh, input. We can easily use this device to capture HDMI and use this USB port on Raspberry Pi 4. Okay, this is a working solution, but what if we want to add another camera? We can simply add another camera here uh, on the USB here. But what if we need another camera like this uh, that has a special uh, cable? Or we have another camera that needs pre-processing of the video before transmitting it uh, to the a camera module so we need a dedicated board for example we can use a Jetson Nano with camera on it in this case we can add another board in our case we will use Raspberry Pi 02 and with a camera connected to it and this cam this board is not running drone engage it is not seen as an independent um, component and independent vehicle on a drone engaged web client. It is just an extension for camera module. It means that we will run another camera module on this board and this camera module communicates with the communicator module here. So the communicator module here handles two camera modules, one running on the same board and one running on this board. So this is my rover. The rover has a Opel board here that con uh, that runs a R2 pilot rover. And I have a Raspberry Pi 4 here. The Raspberry Pi 4 has a HDMI grabber here and has a camera that is connected via cable. This is a separate Raspberry Pi 02 connected to a camera it's not connected now to anything I will leave it here so now let's run drone underscore Cairo uh, unit added drone engage disconnect to it by web Cairo connected to connect. flying board it's connected connect. drone underscore Cairo flight Cairo mode is manual as we can see here we have two streams one of them is the Raspberry Pi 4 here I put my hand here Okay. This is the camera, as you can see, and I can stream from here, HDMI, this is uh, the other HDMI driver here. Now, I use here uh, Raspberry Pi Zero. It runs nothing, it's just uh, connected to this uh, HDMI cable that is connected to uh, this uh, grabber. I will power it on. Let me restart this port. Here it is. As we can see, we can grab a uh, video from uh, HDMI uh, using this grabber and 
we can stream video from the camera at the same time okay now this is not the most important feature the most important feature is that we need to stream from this camera on, for, is that uses this port and this port is connected to this raspberry bar i will disconnect now this raspberry bar zero and we'll connect this camera here as we can see another camera a third camera appeared here and it is part of the same vehicle the same drone engage which is raspberry by four and now we can stream from it here it this is the mobile that i'm using this is the vehicle so this third camera is capturing video and sending it and it's being controlled from this raspberry by four the raspberry by four is a motherboard here of drone engage and there is a running camera module here and there is a running camera module here that controls the camera here and the uh, grabber here the video grabber and there is uh, the second uh, video uh, the second video module is running on this port and is uh, co uh, controlling this scan you can make more you can add more uh, boards and you can make more complex solution uh, as i said for drone engage is very flexible and the idea behind it is that you can add many boards you can add a separate board for the map link you can add uh, a separate board for the communicator there is no limit uh, for adding boards thank you for watching this video bye